Add branding and components to the community. Category 1 biking community is in great shape. In this step, add custom branding, update components and put the finishing touches on the community. Begin by adding branding to the community and update the navigation menu. Update the headline. Click the community selector and select builder. Let's see what it is. Still have this open. I'm actually not so sure how to get there if you don't have it open, but uh, anyway, I'm sure you'll find it somehow. Click the headline component, update the headline by as follows Category 1 Biking, welcome to the community. X to cloth the headline in between. Update the theme. Select the theme icon. Click colors. Adjust the colors as you see fit. The last facing arrow next to colors in the contract to contract the menu. Okay, the colors we will just leave as it is. No interest in changing them. Click images to expand the menu. Click upload image icon. Click upload image and choose header JPG from the folder you downloaded earlier. So let's do this. All right, I've uploaded it. X to close theme editor. Update the navigation menu. Click the gray bar across the top to reveal the navigation menu component. Click edit default navigation from the menu on the right. Click Add Menu Item Cases. My Open Cases. And click Save Menu. And close it by clicking on the X. Add the chat snap in and article component. Select the components icon. Enter embed service chat in the component search bar. Select Embed Service Chat and drag it to the right sidebar beneath all the question components.
You can access resource power with a pew. That did not happen, so I guess something improved. Click the components icon to reopen the menu and the trending articles by topic. Okay, apparently they don't want us to set the set up the embedded chat. Click X to close it again. Apparently they don't want us to set up anything there either. Adjust the content security policy. Content security policy is a web standard that defines rules to, content, to control the resource of content that can be loaded onto a page. All CSP rules work at the page level and apply to all components and libraries. Adjust the CSP to allow chat agents to run on this community. Select the settings icon, select security. Click the script security level drop down and select allow inline scripts and scripts access to wide listed third party hosts. The can access resource power will appear again. No, it doesn't. That's great. So we don't really need to do this. And the chat in the name. All of this doesn't apply to me, but if it applies for you, then you can do this, but I think I set up, I enabled chat before as well in the, um, in the settings, so maybe that has something to do with it, I don't know. So publish your community, click publish on the publish your community confirmation screen, click publish and got it. Maybe they improved something about the chat in the meantime. Let's click verify. And we will get on to the last step, I think after this, of testing out the community that we have created. So just uh, to recap what we did here, put down the point, that's great. We updated the headlines, updated the theme, updated the navigation menu, added the chat, adjusted the content policy and published it in the end was a short video again, uh, nine minutes. If you don't have time to watch the next video, uh, thank you so much for watching and have a great day. If you have time to watch the next video, click the like button anyway. If you liked it, hit subscribe to see more videos. And uh, you can find the link to the next video to the playlist in the description below. See you in the next video.